Ma. Ma. A E I O U. And sometimes why? Uh, how thou, brown cow? How thou, brown cow? Excuse me, what? Your trees. If you would have graced us with your presence during last class, you'd know that everyone was instructed to perform an extensive study of a tree and present their findings this morning. Like in a report? In a painting? Would someone care to show Mr. Foster? Gladly, sir. Thank you, Marcus. You're obviously something strong, something tall. You're almost menacing, but still inviting. I think you're a redwood. Yes, sir. I am the mighty California redwood. A mighty redwood. Masterfully done, Marcus. As always. Okay, who's next? Uh, I'll go, sir. Matthew. Anyone? Dogwood. American larch. Spruce. Evergreen? He's obviously a bramble. You can see it in the way he's tangled himself. It's as if he's wrestling internally with a struggle so deep, he's tangled beneath the weight of it all. Matthew. What she said. Excellent. Katie, since you got it right, would you care to go next? Besides the fact that this is crazy? Mr. Foster, acting is all about embracing the transformation into a character. In order to truly become another character, one must be completely aware of every facet of their being. If one cannot embody every facet of something as simple as a tree, how can one ever possibly capture the complexities of another human being? Look, I'm only here because art history was already full, and I needed a fine art credit. Excuse me, I'm... You know, son, I still recall my first ever role as an actor. I was cast as Big Pine, my first grade pageant. From the moment I put on that pine cone hat, I knew that I was destined to do this. Something as simple as... Still a tree <sighs> over here. You're right, Katie, you may sit down. Weeping Willow. I was Weeping Willow in case anyone cares. Mr. Foster, Mr. I'm only here because art history was full. Everyone else is gone. It's your turn. But they had all weekend. Perhaps you won't miss class next time then. Okay, fine. <clears throat> He's a juniper. He's a cactus. Uh, definitely a juniper. With the way they sing, he's definitely a cactus. Knock it off. You're both wrong. I'm a bonsai tree. You bastard! What the hell? You couldn't have literally picked any other tree in the world. Yeah, that's pretty low, even if you didn't like the guy. What the hell is going on here? Professor Stanley's wife left them last fall for a karate instructor. The wounds are 
pretty fresh. <sighs> Too soon, man. Too soon. Hey, bonsai tree!